Hello everyone, welcome to JC Construction Guitars. First of all, I want to thank everyone for subscribing to the channel. We have 34 subscribers right now. And um, the goal here is to try to reach up to 100 subscribers in a couple of months here so we can share this great channel with everyone. I want to thank Terry and Eric for subscribing to the channel. Terry, thank you for your comment. We'll make sure we're wearing our latex glove when we deal with the goof off here. It's very, um, according to the MSDS sheets. And also I want to thank Eric here for liking the channel. Everyone, I love it when you uh, leave your comments. It helps me out to make this channel better. So please leave your comments, man. Um, today, what we're gonna talk about is drywall anchors. I built this little jig here. Okay, little jig, little jig. Uh, kind of simulate a wall. A lot of my friends always ask me, hey Joe, I want to install a little hanger on the wall here, uh, maybe to hang clothes or maybe to hang my guitars, right? There's so many different types of drywall anchors out there. I'll show you a couple of types that I like to use and I'll show you a couple of ways that you can drill into the wall without like damage things in the back or kind of explain what really happens behind the wall so you have that confidence to go in and do this work yourself. However, disclaimer, make sure if you're not sure what you're doing, go get a professional to do that work for you. Sometimes it is worth it. Um, actually, most of the time it's worth it. You get a professional to do it for you. It's quicker, um, right? And sometimes the, the money you spend on buying all the tools is almost like, might as well hire a professional to do it. So, but, however, there's no reason why you can't do it yourself too. You really understand what you're doing. So hopefully this video really helps you. I'll see you in the next segment. Thank you. Hello everyone, welcome back. I have four different types of anchors here which I'm gonna show you and I'm gonna show you a couple of tips and tricks on installing the anchors. Tip number one, make sure you use the correct drill bit to install your anchors. When you're drilling through the wall, make sure you don't wiggle the drill bit. Your plug type anchors works on the principle of fitting it snug to the hole that you make and friction fit it. And as you are drill installing, not drilling, installing your, your screw, it will expand and holds it to the drywall. Next tip I'm gonna give you. To determine the thickness of the drywall. Half of the time, 80% of the time, your drywall is gonna be half inch. What you do is you measure from the top of the tip of the bit down half inch, make a mark. Put it in your drill, start drilling at a place at the bottom of the wall where it's not noticeable. Stop at that mark, take the bit out, flip it to the blunt side, poke it through. If it goes through very easily, that means it's probably half inch. If you need to use a little bit of force to punch it through, that's gonna be five inch drywall. Let's look at the back and see how that will affect the whole system here. So now we are in the back of the wall here. Your blunt side, like I said. Take a look at this. If you poke through down here, just that half inch mark, it's gonna stop right behind the wall. And if there's a piece of pipe here, you poke through, it's gonna stop you, right? Same with wires. And you're not poking through with the pointy side so you're not gonna damage anything. Very simple, right? So, now you know these tips. I'm gonna go to the next segment of the video and uh, we're gonna do a close up on the anchors and how to install them. Hello everyone, welcome back. Like I said, I'm gonna show you my favorite wall anchors. The three I am pointing to is the wall plug type, good up to 10 to 15 pounds. This two here is called Fisher brand, and this one is a standard Home Depot brand. Next one here, it's called Easy Anchor. Closer look, it has a Phillips head insert, or star head insert. What you do, you grab, a Phillips screwdriver, insert it like this, tight against the wall, hold it with your fingers, start it with a three, four turns, 
Then you can remove your fingers and finish the rest of the job. Good up to 50 pounds. Good up to 50 pounds. Last, my favorite, toggler bolt. Toggler bolt. Good up to 200 pounds. What you do is drill a half inch hole or punch a half inch hole. If this is the drywall, it goes through like this. Make sure it passes the back of the drywall. After that, play a close attention to this here and the front here. You push this, it turns 90 degree. Then you pull it tight. You'll sit tight against the back of the drywall. Push this through and remove the tab. Toggler bolt, good up to 200 pounds. I use that to install all my guitars, hangers. In the next video clip, I'm gonna install one of these anchors. Gonna install this, easy anchor, and this, the toggler bolt. Okay, everyone, here we go. We're gonna start. We're gonna start with the uh, plug type anchor here. So, got the correct drill bit, got the drill. Put this in. So I'm gonna do an example on how I'm gonna start that hole. You know what we talk about investigation. So I know we're half inches from the tip. Been doing this for a while now, right? So I'm gonna go here. Start my hole. So it's about there. Back it off. Take the bit out. Flip to the blunt side. Hook it right through. So it went through pretty easily. Okay. Now I'll get the plug, push it right in. So to finish off this little bit here, it's still sticking out. Don't go and grab the hammer right away, guys. Grab something softer. Like, I've got a screwdriver here with the back. Just punch it. See? It's plastic, not gonna do too much damage. It's flush the wall. To finish it off, it's very simple. Grab the correct screw and screw it in. Simple. Now we're gonna move on to this type of anchor here. Okay, the easy anchor. Same thing, wrap this cell here. What I said, right? Put it through like this. So if it's this, you're new to this, hold it with your hand like this, but I'm used to it. So I'm just gonna push it tight, right? Then you go. This, very simple. So you can just turn and turn and turn. Okay, it's going in now. There you go, just like that. And it's nice and flush. What you do now is grab the correct screw I got here, right? You screw it in, screw whatever you have to screw. There you go, easy anchor, simple. It's supposed to be easy, right? Okay. And I'm gonna move on to toggle bolt next and have some fun with it. Here's a toggle bolt. Let's say, hey, I don't got a screwdriver or not a screwdriver, I don't got a drill. Right, no drill bit. What do I do? Well, the goal is to create a half inch hole. So what we can do, if all I got is this, let's try to punch a half inch hole through. Okay. So we'll take our time, went through. Now what we can do is enlarge this hole, like so. About half inch. Okay, there you go. Next, push this right through. Pass the back of the drywall, like I said. Pull it back. This tab, this tab here, like I said, push it in. Okay. Right. 
Okay, so sometimes you need some help with the screwdriver. Okay, after you push it in, what you can do is spread the tab. Sometimes you have to punch it a little bit to get it flush. Now it's all flush. What you do is you find the correct bit here. Or what do you call it? Uh, the correct bolt. Put it through. And that's it. Okay, now I'm gonna flip to the back and show you what's gonna happen. So, as you can see up here, earlier I did some tests already. There's my toggle, toggle, toggle bolt. Went through, hits the back. Once you start screwing, it will um, grab onto it and uh, get it tight. I got more samples here as well. And then you can see here, these are my metal anchors up here too. And then here, you'll see all the uh, wall plugs that I installed. So give you guys a closer look here. Okay, everyone, can you see it? Perfect. Okay, thank you. And I'll see you in the next section. Hello everyone, I hope you liked the video. If you like what you see, please leave a comment, like it, subscribe to the channel, and share with all your friends. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.